Leslin Lewis is clear on what she thinks leaders should and shouldn't do. When we elect officials to represent us, they do not have unfettered power to instruct city officials, city employees on how to conduct their, their, um, their jobs. That's Lewis last fall. She was the lawyer representing a music festival that claimed it was unfairly shut down by the city of Vaughan. As a government official, we are elected to serve you. Now Lewis is in the running to become an elected official and one of the highest ranking in the country at that as she runs for the leadership of the Conservative Party. My parents left everything behind to come to this great country because they believed that it was the best country in the world to raise their children. Lewis and her family came to Canada from Jamaica when she was just five. She has multiple degrees and practiced law for nearly 20 years. I would support making sure that Canadians are safe. Lewis is a social conservative and says attempts in the past to shield those elements of the Conservative Party have backfired. You have to come out and say exactly what you're for. We've been accused of that in the past as Conservatives having a hidden agenda. I think that the more pragmatic approach is to tell people exactly what you intend to do. Lewis is not a member of Parliament. She did run in the 2015 federal election as a late replacement candidate for the Conservative Party and came in second behind the Liberals. I believe that when Conservatives unite, social conservatives, progressive conservatives, libertarian and fiscal conservatives, we can start the work of healing this great nation. If she wins, Lewis would be the first black woman to lead a national Canadian political party. Vashi Capellos, CBC News, Ottawa.